just of appearance. He did take the damage. Okay, so I was right. So there's a barrier. He probably can see it if he walks into it. He takes the damage and gets revealed, and then it lasts for eight seconds. Move. So for eight seconds, this should be here, and then. So what this basically means is that if we're team fighting in this area, then this dust stays there for twelve seconds, which is pretty good because that means that for. This can basically stay, this can basically reveal an invis here that fights me here for 20 seconds. Uh, I don't know how much it used to last, but it was probably about like 10 or 12 seconds. If I pop it, and he runs, I'll find him. then I still have 8 seconds of chase. So it's still fine for chasing, which is its original purpose. But now it's better for fighting in areas, and the reason that they probably wanted to do this was probably because pros were a little bit over-reliant on needing to use sentries. To protect themselves in team fights, like they'd have to press put a sentry down, and that was the only way that they could reliably get vision. And the other thing is that BKB and other dispel mechanics, like this, doesn't remove it anymore. He'd probably be in biz over here. Now it still works on him. So basically, you can't remove it with BKB anymore. What if we do this? So yeah, and this is the other thing. It's it, it's basically sentry like he can be BKB'd, and it normally wouldn't be applied. Well, I guess it does now because BKB doesn't stop applications. But it's an AOE that can apply. So basically, no matter what happens, if I dust this guy, if he has BKB, if he has Manta, if he's in this AOE when he uses a skill, it's still gonna fucking hit him. He's still dusted. Will do the talking. And he's slower if he's in this, by the way. So if you're an invis hero. Like, Dust is so much better defensively now. So much better defensively. Because you just press it and it gives you an area where you're going to see them no matter fucking what. Unless they're like Slark and uses ulti. So this is a big buff to Dust. Uh, can't run from ganks as Ricky anymore? I mean, you can because Ricky can blink strike away. If you have mobility, it's not a big deal. Like, this is a bad example because it's going to break Dust or whatever. Well, it would have if, if there wasn't free spells. If we turn this off. And he's invis or something. And I use this. It's supposed to do damage. I don't know why I didn't. But if you blink out, then it doesn't matter. You're not in the AoE anymore. You know? You can run. But if you get dusted now, you're kind of just stuck. This way. That seemed to work. I'm not sure why. I'll find him. So... It's not on him, but if I do this, he gets slowed. If I do this, it goes away, kind of. And you can probably mant it off here. Yeah. So you basically, if you want to dispel it, you have to dispel it outside of the radius to remove the debuff. So that means that you have you have to like either kill them here, or lock them down enough to force them to use a dispel at the wrong time. And that means that after they exit, you have eight seconds where you can still see them. So, yeah, much harder for them to get away. And much better as a defensive item, so we're going to see a lot more pro players carrying dust and using dust.